Not only I, but the Israeli government itself thinks that Donald Trump was the best ever president that the United States could have had for Israel. First of all, I don't think that Donald Trump understands foreign policy. I don't think that Donald Trump understands the Middle East. Pluralism is not about us trying to replace. I don't want every Jew in Israel to be reforming conservative. The first official action taken by the Nazis against the Jewish people was a boycott. The Palestinian Authority saying, we're going to use our humanitarian aid to fund terrorism against Jews. Let them say, yes, I am for BDS and I'm still a Zionist. I respect that. If you want to spread lies about Torah, you can go ahead, but that's, it's You're just, me a liar. it's just nothing. I think what you said was untrue, yes. That to me is coward. That doesn't sound very kosher to me. Real pluralism is the right of every Jew to go up and pray on the Temple Mount. Where our real differences is when it comes to halakha. It's a matter of Torah and Sinai or not. There's a real problem with being defined as a negative. I'm not a negative, I'm a positive. I'm a conservative Masorti Jew. They've taken positions that we think are contrary to halakha. We respect the right to be wrong. I will not say, well, I'm right for me, you're right for you, you're right for you. I actually think I'm right. But I also respect you and your right that in my mind you're wrong. But this is the nature of life. We, in our generation, we like the drama, we like these debates. We say never again after the Holocaust, which doesn't mean it's not going to happen again. The adversaries of the Jewish people have tried to make Zionism a dirty word, and it's not. It's a beautiful word. It depends if this is the West Bank and these are illegal settlements. I believe that there are people on the ground who will want something else for the Palestinian people. Is it the right of Israel to impose that? No. Our biggest challenge with the younger generation is they don't really care. We came back to Israel because this is our indigenous native homeland. Slate 14, Kol Israel is in the Zionist manufacturing business. And the cradle of Jewish civilization, the place where that civilization started, is in Judea and Samaria. Under what umbrella, what organization gave you that infrastructure to do it? They talk the talk, but they don't walk the walk. And I'm sorry, Vani, I mean... Herzl is the one that said, if you will it, it is no dream, with an idea that so many people didn't believe.